What I'm demonstrating here is the Omnipresence Ops 241A short range radar. It is connected by a USB cable to a Raspberry Pi. The Raspberry Pi is just an ordinary uh, Raspberry Pi 3. Uh, 2 works just fine. Actually, this one is a 2. Um, and it's connected to a uh, LCD hat. Uh, ordinary Chinese knockoff. It wasn't anything expensive, about 10 bucks. Uh, and then it's connected again by USB to a high amp USB connection. Uh, it being Raspberry Pi, it requires a fair amount of amperage. Uh, 2.5 amp, I believe, is the uh, spec rating. And I believe my adapter is about that. So I'm going to pause it now and plug it in. Okay, so I've made the connection now. And here's the Raspberry Pi booting up. <clears throat> I've done very little to this uh, Raspberry Pi distro. I believe it's uh, just the Jesse uh, that the, was recommended by the LCD manufacturer. Um, using the ordinary LX session that's the desktop. Yes, it's funny having a desktop on a 2.3x2 uh, uh, in screen, and I just have it auto-run the Python script that Omnipresence has up on the GitHub account. And the number here you're seeing is just what is being read off the, the Omnipresence radar. Um, the radar itself has its own lighting system, so as I move my hand in and out faster and faster, you see the numbers change. Slower. Red is inbound. Blue is outbound. Red in fast. Out fast. And that is a functioning short range radar. Uh, I happen to have it set up in this program for meters per second. Uh, it is a simple two character command that gets that can be issued over USB to turn it into miles per hour or any other of the common units that uh, one might want. And it is just set up with the default sample um, sampling, which is a good compromise between uh, accurate for uh, high speed and low speed at 10, uh, 10 kHz. And that concludes this demo.